So let's begin with the following example in which we're going to deal with electromotive force and terminal voltage. So suppose a battery is rated to have an electromotive force of 12 volts. Now when the battery is connected to a device that acts as a resistor, the measured voltage drops to 6.8 volts. If the electric current in our circuit is assumed to be 4 amps, calculate the internal resistance of the battery and the resistance of our device. So, let's begin by looking at the following setup of our electric circuit. So we have a battery that is connected to our circuit and we have two resistors. So lowercase r simply gives us the internal resistance of our battery and this resistor given by uppercase r is the resistance of our device that is connected to our battery. So let's recall the relationship between the terminal voltage that exists across a battery and the electromotive force. So the terminal voltage given by VBA is equal to the electromotive force minus the product of our electric current I and the internal resistance given by lowercase r. So we know what the electromotive force is and we know what our terminal voltage is. Remember, the terminal voltage is simply the voltage difference across our battery when electric current is allowed to flow through our uh, circuit. So we essentially take this equation, rearrange it and solve for our lowercase r. So our internal resistance of the battery given by lowercase r is equal to the electromotive force 12 volts minus the terminal voltage 6.8 volts divided by our electric current of 4 amps and that gives us a resistance of 1.3 ohms. So this is the resistance of our battery which is known as the internal resistance. Now let's move on to part two. In part two we want to calculate what the resistance is of our device. So we want to find uppercase R. So we essentially want to apply Ohm's law. Ohm's law states that the voltage difference across our resistor is equal to the product of the electric current across that resistor multiplied by the resistance of this device. So we know what I is, it's simply 4 amps, and we know what VBA is, it's 6.8 volts. So we solve for R, our resistance of our device is equal to our 6.8 value, that's the terminal voltage, divided by 4 amps, and that gives us 1.7 ohms. So the resistance of our battery is 1.3 ohms, and the resistance of our device is 1.7 ohms.